Assalamu alaikum my one hope you're doing well I'm Nia Fatima and welcome back to my channel Arabic classes with Nia. Today's video we're gonna learn 25 common phrases in Arabic so let's begin. First we have Assalamu alaikum which means peace be upon you and the reply for that is Wa alaikum assalam which means peace be with you too. Now let's see our next word. Our next word is marhaban which means hello or hi and ahlan is the reply for marhaban. Both of them has the same meaning. And our next word is ahlan wa sahlan which means welcome. Let's repeat ahlan wa sahlan. Next we have ahlan wa sahlan ya azizi in male form which means welcome my dear. And in female form, it is known as Ahlan wa sahlan ya azizati. You have to add ta before ya to make it into female form. And next, we have Ahlan wa sahlan ya sadiqi in male form, which means welcome my friend. And in female form, it is known as Ahlan wa sahlan ya sadiqati. You have to add ta before ya. And next, we have good morning, sabah al-khair, and sabah al-noor. And next, we have masa al-khair, which is good evening. And the reply for that is masa al-noor. Let's repeat masa al-noor. And next, we have in male form, kayfa haluka, and in female form, kayfa haluki. This means how are you? Haluka becomes Haluki. And next we have Ana bi khayr shukran wa anti. And Ana bi khayr shukran wa anta. Anta is for male and anti is for female. Which means I am fine, thanks and you. Next we have Ma is muka. Which means what is your name in male form. And when you are asking in the female form, it is ma is muki. Let's repeat, ma is muki. And when you are replying to this question, you have to start with ismi and tell your name. Next, we have man aina anta for male and man aina anti for female, which means where are you from? And when you are replying to that question, you have to start with an amen and tell the place. Next, we have how old are you, which means kam umruka in male form. And when you telling in female form, it is kam umruki. Let's repeat kam umruki. Let's see our next word. And when you're replying to this, you have to tell Anna dash Senawat. For dash, you have to tell how much old are you. Next, we have Sayyidati, which means Madam. And next, we have Sayyidi, which means Sir. This is al which means Today. And next we have Rodan, which means tomorrow. Next we have Kem Them Nhada, which means how much is this? Next we have Ahsenti, which means well done. Let's repeat once again Ahsenti, which means well done. Let's see our next word. And we have the next word as Ana Asifa in female form which means I am sorry. And in male form you have to tell Ana Asif. You should not add ta after it. And next we have Shukran which means thank you. Let's repeat Shukran which means Thank you. And the reply to that is Afwan, 
which means welcome. Let's repeat once again. Afwan, which means welcome. And next we have wada'an, which means goodbye. Let's repeat wada'an, which means goodbye. And next we have ma'asalama, which means be safe. Now let's have a short question and answer session. Question 1. Translate welcome my dear in Arabic. But remember one thing. The question is saying that you need to give your answer in the female form of the sentence. The answer is Ahlan wa sahlan ya azizati. Thank you. Bye. Masalama. Hope you enjoyed this video and see you in my next video.